Guys, I am Sheikh Asif, fourth year mechanical student of MHS College, MHS College of Engineering. We had a one uh, one week training section on robotics from RoboLab. In that, we have uh, built many robots uh, around here. Uh, JCBN is one of the uh, part of that robot. Here, JCBN uh, is a main uh, application of JCB is to uh, carry the load from one point, one point to another point. Actually, they are operated manually, but in this RoboLab, we have to make it programmable. The JCB is a track platform. It contains like uh, two Johnson motor and one servo motor for rotation of the table. It works on the principle of pneumatics. And the parts of JCB are this is a bucket, this boom, this arm, the turntable, track, and the DCV, carrier control walls. And uh, there are the cylinders which are used for the handling of the force. If you see, there are three cylinders one for the boom and two for the arm. The, the cylinder of the arm is larger to handle the large amount of force and the cylinder of the boom and the bucket is smaller because the force handled by the, force handled by the boom and bucket is very small so the area required for cylinder is also very small If you see the cylinder, there are two ports one is inlet port and the other one is the outlet port so Through this, if you are uh, through compressor air, we will send the air through compressor and this air will be given to the, one of the inlet port and uh, this, uh, this air causes the movement of the piston from this position to this position and this will cause the uh, extent, extent of the arm and to contact again arm will supply the air from this point so it will uh, cause the uh, contraction of the arm uh, We operate this uh, JCBN through an app developed by the RoboLab You can see the uh, app will look like this Ok, you can download from the Play Store I will show like movement of the JCBN So forward Stop, backward, stop, right, stop, left, stop, arm contraction, arm extension, the bucket goes. This is a delay we are uh, using to avoid the instantaneous uh, 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 because of the instantaneous uh, extension and contraction there will be damage of the arms so we have provided like a 5 second of delay uh, after each operation so the machine parts will remain safe, safe. and uh, you know that uh, now the table is turned clockwise now it is counterclockwise stop and this is the robot uh, finally developed the help of the robot lab in our 8 days training section and finally we are thanks to RoboLab to conduct this a nice uh, workshop, uh, workshop in our college and thank to uh, Amul sir, Dikijay sir and Rajesh sir so supporting us and we will uh, start from this we will begin for us we will go for the robot